facts about sea otters by Tilly. Sea otters are not only super cute and lovable, they are also a keystone species in their Pacific coast habitat. Here are some fun facts about these gorgeous creatures. For most sea otters, Alaska is home. Approximately 90% of the world's sea otters live in coastal Alaska. However, some southern sea otters live as far south as California. They stick together for protection against predators by floating on the ocean waves in groups that are called rafts. These rafts are usually gender-based, meaning they are boy rafts and girl rafts. Sometimes sea otters like to hold hands. Holding paws allows sea otters to keep their delicate paw pads warm. Sea otters protect and carry their young by floating on their backs and holding their babies on their tummies. A baby sea otter is called a pup. Sea otters can have a pup any time of the year. Female sea otters raise their pups without assistance from males. Sea otters' diet includes sea urchins, crabs, mussels and clams, which they're known to crack open with rocks. Sea otters can eat as much as 25% of their body weight in food every day. To find food, sea otters can dive as deep as 250 feet and will use their sensitive whiskers to locate small prey inside crevices or their strong forepaws to dig for clams. They come back to the surface to eat while floating on their backs. An otter's lung capacity is 2.5 times greater than that of similar sized land mammals. Sea otters have been known to stay submerged for more than 5 minutes at a time. Unlike seals, walruses and other marine mammals, sea otters do not have a layer of blubber. Instead, they have a dense, water-resistant fur to keep warm. Their fur contains between 600,000 to 1 million hair follicles per square inch. Sea otters spend a large portion of their days grooming and conditioning their fur. This traps air and heat next to their skin. Otters are an essential keystone species of the Pacific Coast ecosystem. A keystone species is a species that is critical to how an ecosystem functions because it has large-scale effects on the communities in which it lives. Along the Pacific coast, sea otters help to control the sea urchin population. Fewer sea urchins in turn help prevent kelp forests from being overgrazed. Sea otter activity therefore helps to improve beds of ocean seagrass which in turn develops a more diverse ecosystem. Nowadays US and international law protects threatened sea otters. This gorgeous creature was sadly hunted to the edge of extinction by fur traders in the 18th and 19th centuries. About only 2,000 sea otters remained by the time they became protected by the International Fur Seal Treaty in 1911. The outlook for sea otters is uncertain even today. There are still only 3,000 sea otters living in the wild. It is important that we redouble our efforts to conserve this beautiful and vital creature.